Hey guys, what is up? Dave here coming back to you with a brand new video on the channel and today is a video asking the 1320 community what they want. Do they want this? Do they not want this? I have created a way that you can launch in a specific gear on 1320 challenge. Uh, I've set it for second or third, not fourth, fifth or sixth. And the idea for this came from me watching um, some old street laws, street outlaws videos where I overheard somebody say that they were going to launch in second because of the road conditions. And that made me think that could make some cars more bracket raceable in 1320 challenge. So what I did was when Paul sent me a race to my F type for bracket, I realized I don't want to run this thing bracket, but if I can launch in a specific gear, Maybe I will run it bracket. I like bracket racing. I like the idea of it. It makes um, two cars that are otherwise not fair to race against each other fair to race against each other. So let's just, you know, I figured I'd mess with it. And if you watch the gear shifter on the far right here, I'm going to launch in third. And it's going to immediately go to third. It's not going to be like, oh, you're pressing W really quickly. It immediately goes to third gear. I feel like with some arcade liberties of launching in third, that's completely fine, and it makes some cars very bracket raceable that are otherwise not bracket raceable in 1320 Challenge at all. So I wanted to leave it up to the community. Is this something you want? If we were to add this to the next update, is this something you would want for bracket racing to make some cars that you can't otherwise bracket race now bracket raceable? I want to bring more awareness and more racers to bracket racing rather than, Jesus Christ, rather than just, you know, the same old everybody's a head-to-head -head racer. That's kind of how this game is. Everybody's a head-to-head -head racer except for, like, maybe two dozen people. So, let's see if we can maybe bring some awareness to bracket racing. If you like this idea for a feature, I suck at RTs today. So don't look at me that way. Wow, this thing's consistent. Holy crap. Let me know what you guys think on the Discord or in the comments down below or both. Do you want specific gear launching? I guess is what I'm going to call it, is specific gear launching. Do you want this or do you want uh, something more along the lines of like... I don't know, do we just not put this in, I guess is the better way to look at it. That's the only two things that I can really think of. And it does not aid much in head-to-head uh, -head racing at all. I was kind of worried about that, you know, launching into a higher gear with nitrous. It actually even makes head-to-head -head cars, you know, launchable for bracket racing. So, like, for example, here's my Ram SRT10 that I'm about to give away. It's bracket raceable because of, you know, it's 100% bracket raceable. Yeah, it's slow off the line, but that's just something that some uh, ratios could fix or something like that. Or, you know, maybe you bracket race with nitrous, which is just a crazy thing to think about. I'm going to try it. Uh, let's see what it runs. Oh, that's right. Well... I'm just not going to finish the race. Little tip, don't finish the race if you launch and break your car. Also, don't refill the nitrous on this car. <laughs> uh, don't do it. <laughs> uh, that doesn't give you an advantage, by the way. I promise. Um, it's just bottomless nitrous, basically. Another form of it that I discovered. Let's see what this thing does with nitrous. Because it's bottomless anyway. Well, almost bottomless. It uses like 20 units of NOS per race. So, eh, you know, you're going to have nitrous for a long time on this truck. <laughs> but let me know what you think. Do you guys want this? Do you guys not want this? Is there a specific way that this should work? I don't know what this thing runs. Hold on a minute. Let's try this on something else that's 
normally a head-to-head -head car because I suffer from it too. All my cars are head-to-head -head except for like my broken Civic that thinks it's max HP, but then when you dyno, dyno it, it's not. We're going to launch this in second first, no nitrous. Just see what it runs. Yes, I know the rear taillights turn on when I use this. I did that on purpose just to know it's working. But, I don't know. I feel like this isn't a bad idea, actually, for once. It does change the landscape of bracket racing, but I think it's for good rather than anything else. Largely just because, you know, there's... Not many people running bracket races, and that's because they can't run their car's bracket. But depending on how you set up your ratios with this, you can. So, see what this thing does with nitrous. I think it's using it. 8083. Let's see how consistent that is. That was a second gear launch. And do it again. And the way that this works is the two key and the three key above WASD. Two for second gear, three for third gear. 805. This thing is fun. It's fun to bracket now. Let's see what it does in third. We're going to third with nitrous. Just see what it does. And it's shitty off the line, but I would love to find a way to incorporate launch control as well wow this could be an 8599 car with third gear launch with my ratios the way they are this is a fun car now one of my favorite bracket ets is 8599 and 8533 i don't know why 8499 is great too because that's a realistic index racing et but i don't know this is fun i like this idea for racing let me know what you guys think either on the Discord or down in the comments down below. Neat preview. If you stayed this long into the video, you see a McLaren. Anyway, peace out.